You have zero memories of the love that first impacted your life because it existed before your life. We think of first love as our first experience with love. We remember how we met and what was said. We remember what life was like beforehand and how it changed. We remember how it felt, captivating. All of it seared in our memories with a definite time and place. But actually, your first love didn't involve you. Not really. It wasn't anything you said. It wasn't because you knew the right thing to do. Wasn't that you looked a certain way or dressed a certain way? It wasn't about the family you grew up in or the connections you had. You weren't in the right place at the right time. It wasn't a feeling, no goosebumps or butterflies. It wasn't long walks and even longer phone calls. It wasn't a look deep into your eyes or a touch that made you tingle. You have zero memories of the love that first impacted your life because it existed before your life. Before land, before sea, before creation, you were loving me. Before space, before time, I was on your mind. memories of the love that first impacted your life because it existed before your life. God purposed to love you. No matter how far your heart may be from him or how little you think of him, he loves you. You, with all your flaws and funky attitudes. Yeah, he knows better than anybody how messed up you are. He loves you anyway, and it's a fierce love, a relentless love, a sacrificial love. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. And when the whoever is you, when you believe, that's because of his love. Ephesians 2, but God being rich in mercy because of his great love with which he loves us, even when we were dead in our transgressions, made us alive together with Christ. By grace, you have been saved. Your first love loves you unconditionally. In Christ, that's eternally. Romans 8, neither death, nor life, nor angels, nor principalities, nor things present, nor things to come, nor powers, nor height, nor depth, nor any other created thing will be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus. No there's no other love like this. We love him because he first loved us. Before land, before sea, before creation, you were loving me. Before space, before time, I was on your mind. of the love that first impacted your life because it existed before your life. 